Covering St. John's County, News 4 Jax just received a 911 call reporting gun violence last night in a home in Volano Beach. Today, the sheriff's office released the names of a husband and wife. Deputies say 71-year-old John Reed shot and wounded his wife, 61-year-old Tracy Cunningham, and then shot and killed himself. A neighbor called police. Sir. Yeah. Okay, is he breathing? We don't know. He shot himself in the face, okay, in the head. Sir, is the weapon still there? Yeah, the weapon's in his hand. News 4 Jacks reporter Zach Lajway is outside the St. John's County Sheriff's Office with an update on Tracy Cunningham. Authorities tell me Cunningham is in critical condition and has already underwent one surgery. As she continues to fight for her life, community members tell me they're shocked. This is just a very nice people. Everybody knows everybody around here. Um, I don't know what else to say. It's shocking. Terry Scarborough has lived in Volano Beach for almost a decade. He says he rides his bike through the neighborhood every day. I used to see the guy feed the cats all the time. I Sky 4 flew over the neighborhood where the shooting happened. Neighbors we spoke to on Jerez Court, who did not want to go on camera, say they are in disbelief that Reed would kill himself after shooting his wife. That individual was still conscious, alert, talking with us. Um, however, there was some uh, deteriorating conditions that were on set there with that, that traumatic event. Um, so she was, of course, immediately loaded up by fire rescue personnel, loaded into an air ambulance and taken to the Orange Park Medical Trauma Center where she was treated, uh, had surgery last night, and where she remains today in critical condition. Chuck Mulligan with the St. John's County Sheriff's Office says Cunningham and Reed were married only months ago. Well, obviously there was an argument exactly what was being said. We don't know. Mulligan says someone was on the property at the time of the shooting and went to a neighbor's home to call 911. Mulligan also says Cunningham has family members, but detectives have not found any immediate family members for Reed. In St. John's County, Zach Lajway, Channel 4, The Local Station.